So, um, after 35 days or about that, and your tomatoes are ready to be transplanted, you can actually transfer them either to the bed that you make in the open field or you transfer them into bags. Yes, you can actually grow your tomatoes in bags. That's one exciting thing about growing this vegetable. They are easy to manage and they thrive. If you don't have space, you can grow them in bags or in containers and have them ready. If you want to transfer the plants to the open field and you have made beds, it's important that you note that the beds should be about one meter wide. This is very important so that it can accommodate the plants that you are transferring. Also, the space between the beds or the furrow spacing should be also one meter wide. That really helps you manage your plant well and aids ventilation in your farm. If you are using a bag, that is you want to grow your tomatoes inside bags, then you should fill the bags up to 30 cm high so that the roots of your plants will be comfortable and not struggle to penetrate. Then the mixture inside that bag should be about 70% of soil, very good rich soil and 30% of compost. That is also very important to note. Transplanting should be done in the evening one of the reasons is that there's something called transplanting shock. You know, having removed the, um, the transplants from the nursery and now putting them in a new environment, most times they have to absorb some level of shock. So to ease that, you just want to make sure that in the cool of the evening, when there isn't so much sunlight, you transfer them and then make sure that you water them to help them adjust to the new conditions. We have a video on how you should rightly transplant your vegetables. Check the link below and then you see how you can do that. Also, just a quick question for you. Have you tried transplanting any vegetable at all during the day just before the sun or while there is um, sunlight? What was your experience like? I would like to know in the comment section.